man behind me, the man I'm getting ready to introduce, is somebody who has kept his word and is a true friend of law enforcement. And if you're a friend of law enforcement, then you're a friend to the whole community and all the citizens of Virginia. There's no way anybody can doubt what you've done for law enforcement across the state of Virginia and the Commonwealth. Definitely prove yourself. Well, you guys have been denying that. You got an awful lot of y'all put yourselves on, on the line too to, to fight for the things you fought for. Yeah, you. So I, you were there. I'm gonna be there for you. I, I think that was probably one of the biggest highlights of your four years as our governor. Uh, the fact that you were able to to bring Republicans and Democrats to the table and tell them that say this is for Virginia. It's not for your side. It's not for your side. This is the right thing to do. Five years ago, when I first ran for sheriff, my 85-year-old grandfather called me and said, I'd like to do something I've never done. And I asked him what that might be, and he said, wish a Republican good luck. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you, I'm here today to wish Mark Warner good luck. <laughs> and it's not because as a honored or proud Republican, I'm honored to stand with Mark Warner. I feel like this election is not about party affiliations. It's about picking the right man for the job. Mark Warner's already demonstrated to us his abilities. It's through his words, his deeds, his hard work that he is the right person for the job. Uh, I feel like that's who Virginians need to represent us in the U.S. Senate. Uh, also, that's the leadership that we need in Washington desperately in the times we live today. Mark Warner is a friend of mine, a friend of law enforcement, and I know he will represent us as Democrats and Republicans, and that's why I support Mark Warner. Governor Warner just didn't hear, he listened. He listened to the concerns and he took action. And that's why it's really my pleasure to be standing here and endorsing Mark Warner, because I know what he did in Virginia, he can take to Washington, and he can bring people together, and that's what we need. Uh, with that, I'd like to introduce the next United States Senator from Virginia, the overwhelming majority of sheriffs who are committing in this race or publicly supporting any candidate or supporting our candidacy. You know, uh, public safety is one of the core services of government. Lots of politicians talk about supporting public safety, but the way you're judged is not by your words but by your actions. The fact that these men and women have put their lives on the line and their deputies have put their lives on the line each and every day to protect the Virginians to have their public support. Uh, it's a banner day for me and a banner day for the campaign.